Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another Diablo 3 quick tip with the four chord jester. I noticed the other day I had a ring drop. It didn't look like a very powerful ring, but I was kind of surprised at the difference in DPS that I was able to get just by equipping that ring. It's really weird. So it's a t compound two part tip. First tip when you're starting off here especially in act one uh, there's always going to be a merchant in town that sells rings It's always in your best interest to check them out so uh, for example act one when you finally get to doing the blacksmith's crown and you gotta go find the blacksmith you'll have access to this NPC Radic the fence he'll have a trinkets Trinkets are rings. And, you know, they they might be good, they might be bad, but hey, at level 5, level 6, they're better than nothing. So you always buy them. You should be able to get up, you know, three, 4,000 gold early into the game very easily. No problem. So always check out Radic Defense. Now the other thing here is, for example, check out my ring. True Ring of Agony. 5 to 10 damage, 25 dex, 28 intelligence. Doesn't sound like a lot, does it? Now I'm a level 42, level 41 demon hunter. 5 to 10 damage? That's nothing. No problem. I had a ring here at 44 dexterity. Now I have a 5 to 10 ring with 25 dex. Who cares about the int? If I take away that ring, I drop 100 and, well, 150 DPS. It's not the dexterity. It's really not. Like, I do not want to sell that. Let's bring it back. 1570. Let's take away 70 decks. Does not take away even close to the same amount of DPS. It's that 5 to 10 damage. So, go out to the auction houses. Find rings of plus damage. If you find Radic the Fence or whoever the Fence, they're in every act. Every NPC has a The Fence character. And you find one of 5 to 10 damage, 6 to 11, 2 to 3. K buy those rings. It will severely help you out. And that, that's no lie. 170 DPS between 25 decks and 5 to 10 damage. And it's not the decks. Next tip, rings with sockets. If you find a socketed ring, that is money for you. I mean, check this out. Right now, I'm running some gems. 22 dexterity, no problem. This bow has a 14 to 28 gem in it. That gem alone gives me something like 200 DPS. People love sockets. You find rares with sockets. I think I sold a socketed ring. A rare socketed ring had like 50 strength on it in a socket. I think I sold it for 35,000 gold. And that was a low ball estimate. So you want to start playing the auction house, you want to start enhancing your character, go out, find these rings of plus damage, and they will just let you mow down your enemies. No problem. So this has been Forecourt Jester, another quick tip here in Diablo 3. Go forth and vanquish your enemies.